Okay, we're going to balance our chemical equations. For number one, the first thing we're going to do is count how many elements of each, or how many atoms of each element we have in the reactants and products. So on the left we have two hydrogens. On the right we have two hydrogens. On the left we have one oxygen atom plus two oxygen atoms equals three oxygen atoms. On the right we have two oxygen atoms. Okay, so the easiest thing to do is to, uh, you know, multiple of two, the lowest multiple of two would be four. So we want four oxygens on the left. So to get that, we need a two here. So it's two times one is two oxygens, plus two oxygens is four. So that's how we get four. So we need four oxygens on the right. So we need a number times two equals four, so that would be two. Now our hydrogens, we have to see how it changed. So two times two is four hydrogens. And on the right, we have 2 times 2 is 4 hydrogens. So that is the balanced chemical equation. For number 2, we're going to do the same thing. Count how many atoms of each element we have on each side. So we have so one sodium on the left, one on the right. Bromines, we have one on the left and two on the right. Calciums, we have one on the left, one on the right. And bromines... Oh, I'm sorry, not bromines, but fluorines. We have two on the left and one on the right. So just pick one to start balancing. So it looks like, well, I'm just going to do fluorines. We have two on the left, one on the right, so we need two here. So to do that, we put a two right here. That also now gives us two sodiums. So let's balance the sodium, so we need two over here, so put a two here. That also now gives us two bromines. And it looks like we're all balanced now. All right, number three, our last one. We have a lot of elements here, so let's just write down elements. So hydrogen, sulfur, oxygen, sodium, nitrogen. Let's do the same thing over here. Let's just you know write down what elements we have. Now we're going to count how many atoms we have in each element. So hydrogen, we have two on the left one on the right. Sulfur, we have one on the left, one on the right. Oxygen, we have four plus two is six on the left. On the right, we have two plus four is six on the right also. So sodium, we have one on the left, two on the right. And nitrogen, we have one on the left and one on the right. So well, let's just pick one element. Let's take a look at sodium. So sodium, we have one on the left, two on the right. So let's balance sodium. So we put a 2 here, it gives us 2 sodiums, but now it also gives us 2 nitrogens, and also 2 times 2 is 4, 4 plus 4 is 8, so it gives us 8 oxygens. Alright, so let's do this nitrogens now. So we need 2 on the right, so we put a 2 here, that gives you 2 nitrogens. That also gives us now um, 2 hydrogens, and then 2 times 2 is 4, 4 plus 4 is 8 oxygens. So stand back and take a look at what we have now. So sulfur is refined, hydrogen is refined, we have two each, oxygen we have eight each, sodium is two each, and nitrogen two each. So now we have the final balance chemical equation.